Hello and welcome, welcome back. I'm Habbage, and I'm delighted you guys decided to drop by for a little hardcore vanilla Minecraft action. Let's get it kicked off and going once again. So we are currently uh, working on wrapping up our villagers. We we desperately need one more uh, book trade, and that's Unbreaking 3. Now there's others we could, could use, and that's kind of been our Achilles here. We had to expand our... A uh, little hangout here because um, we keep getting trades like uh, Fortune 3 and Smite 5 and Impaling 5. You know, things that, yeah, that's not exactly what we needed, but either they were such a good price or uh, for whatever other reason we couldn't, uh, couldn't exceed... Um, that ability so i think what i'm going to do we've got three guys in beds and i, I think we're going to stick with that um the other possibility or need from around here is at some point we need to make our way back we still have a whole load of potatoes um harvested but sitting in crates that we hadn't brought over and um we will want to Oh, we're going to need to make an axe, too. All right, what do you got? Quick charge, too. Uh, this should get us through quite a few, though. Infinity, got it. Uh, yeah, so I guess at some point we'll have to go back and get an axe. We'll uh, get the potatoes at that point. Although I actually think we brought some iron uh, for more lanterns, so we can... You can probably just keep going here. Channeling. And I'm really... I, you know, we we don't know. I, I want to say I'm hopeful that we'll, we'll get this here quick and get on to other things, but... Um, this is our, our big commitment at the moment. We spent a lot of time and a lot of energy getting this all ready to go. And that is the book that uh, that we really still need. We uh, again a cheap efficiency five would go a long way too. We've got a four, uh, but a five is always great, and that's not a cheap. I don't know if we have power. I should maybe when we go to uh, go to repair this axe. We'll check everything that we've got because it's it's getting a little hazy that this is always the challenges you get late i know the know the ones i really need um oh, you. nothing do uh do wish we'd done the floor. I mean, water under the bridge now. All those guys are set. We don't have to worry about it more. But um, the stone floor is much easier. Paling five. I think one we already got it. But two sixty-two is way too expensive. Where do you want to go? Go wherever you need to, but leave me out of it. Feather falling one. Um, I think we got a feather falling four, right? I think that was an early one. That is the, the challenge. These spread out over multiple episodes, and, and for me, multiple days. So it gets a little tougher to remember what what's going where, who's taking what. So we shall see.
Maybe it was impaling. Is that the same one? I, man, now it's all it's all becoming a blur. I'm going to clearly need some more coffee today, guys. So, heads up for that. work off that. Yep. Yeah, that's the way to do it. Three we already have. whole lot of nothing. So if you haven't already out in YouTube land, uh, I'm not going to be offended if you want to <laughs> kind of fast forward through the video. I know I'd probably be doing it. Um, if you see this kind of thing constantly, just keep going because we're here until we'll have to make a new axe. Um shortly but um, kind of going to be hanging out here Do 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 on breaking three. So now that it, now that all the quick quick in and out people are gone, now we can really have fun villagers. That's right. Now I can talk to you heart to heart. So listen up. On breaking three is what we want. That's right. You and me. Right here. Look, we got we got people expecting to be entertained, and this, this ain't it. Let's see, like sing or dance or something, dude. Okay. Pull out a six shooter like the Wild West show back in the day, and throw up a pack of cards, shoot the aces. I don't know. It's, blow them away if you're not gonna give me an unbreaking three. I mean, I mean, blow them away as an audience, not, not literally. I don't even know if you have a gun. Frankly, that's a reckless way to shoot a gun. So don't aim it up in the sky and shoot at flipping around cards. Those bullets got to come down somewhere, you know. Well, I keep exp there we go. Had to happen sometime. Ugh. With all the channeling, by the way. 
All right, here we go. A few sticks. I don't think I have sticks here. Make a pair of axes. You know, we could could be using the uh, the diamond axe. Um, speed things up a little bit. It's the wear and tear and all that, and then having to go get levels to repair it that I, I'm a little worried about. I don't know. Let's try to at least finish up with this guy, and then. If things are still going, okay, we can maybe switch over just for just for variety's sake. Oh, bedtime. Um, this time, since things are just turning tonight, let's go, let's go grab our taters. I always see that lava down under the water and I think, uh oh, watch out. Now, of course, I just told all of you guys to skip ahead until we left because we weren't leaving. Well, false alarm. We made new axes, and then it got to be nighttime. So I'm just running to grab the potatoes, bring those back. We do want to feed up the farmer villagers uh, now that their extra beds have been cleared so they can get back to breeding up uh, additional villagers just to kind of keep the population topped off. It's possible that we could need to add more uh, more trading bays, um, or even beyond that, you know, we may want to switch out to, uh, additional, additional villager types. I'm going to drink some coffee. All right. So all we want to do here is make sure that this creeper doesn't get us. Make sure that there's no... Oh, don't you stop like that. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now we haven't done our... Is he in the cows? I can take you. Come on, man. Ooh, you don't like that fire, huh? Hey, man, he's very jumper roundy. Come on. Ah, missed. <laughs> All right, that's one. That was not pretty, by the way. I I thought we had a lot more potatoes than this. Uh oh. Um. Guess we'll do that. I I guess we ran over the potatoes at some point. I don't remember having done that, but well. Or did I put them in another chest accidentally? Let's just be sure before we... Before we go running off. That does appear to be about it. Man, that is so weird. I know we have more wheat, but I want to keep that for the... You take all the beets? I guess we did. Oh. So we're saving that for the cows. Fact. Go ahead and 
take that over. I won't do any harvesting here, just uh just feeding. We had taken both cows and chickens fairly recently. And the chickens I'm not worried about bringing back up. You know, we'll kind of just drop in there if we need a shot of XP. Um, axe them up real good. Oh, and uh, call that done. All right, well, there we go. Let's uh, drop off this pearl. That's one ender chest. Once we get the rest of the ingredients, of course. And they live here, I think. Anything else that while we're here that I, I'm not thinking of? I can put these shears away. Anything else while I'm here that I'm not thinking of? I don't think so. All right, back we go. More, more villager trying. Oh, I always say absence makes the heart grow fonder. Well, hopefully, villager will be fond of me since I've been gone and will want to give me awesome trade for Unbreaking 3. Carrots for all. I'm just going to dump all of these to them. Let them sort it out. Should be enough of them to easily figure that out. Alright, my friend. I saw your little green bubbles there. Was that because I hadn't been around and you were just ignoring your lectern? Or was that you were switching back to a awful paper-only trade? These have been just garbage. Really, instead of my absence making him fonder, he got, got a little sad. <sighs> Awful. Awful. Pretty awful. Still awful. Da, 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 da.
So what do you guys like to do? I don't know if anybody's watching, but if anybody's watching, drop me a comment. What do you guys like to do when you're doing these kinds of grindy things in Minecraft? Or is this is this too much? Do you never get done with setting up, oh man, a bunch of uh, librarians or other kinds of traders because trying to get the right trains is just too frustrating? It's not for me. I really don't mind it. I do. I do struggle right now knowing you guys aren't aren't really too entertained by this. Maybe if you are, let me know that. I mean, I I will watch let's plays of streamers or YouTubers that I enjoy, and I'll watch them all the way through in the background while I'm doing other stuff. And you know, I, I'm never just sitting there munching popcorn watching to see what happens next. So I enjoy seeing how others deal with this kind of stuff. But I think I'm a little off in that. I, clearly, the numbers indicate that uh, that most people aren't looking for a bunch of villager trading um, content. Which always kind of amazes me because you know apparently what a lot of people are into is the same, the same tutorials. <laughs> you can find like four hundred tutorials on how to make an iron farm, and uh, they're all a variety of vague. It's tough to find. It, you know, it, like being a good teacher or or anything else. It takes a lot of practice and a lot of know how to really understand how to make something entertaining and educational at the same time to where people actually want to watch it and that's you know that's where the idea of clickbait comes in right it's, oh yeah you're gonna say that you know you know it's just kind of trash but you're hoping people will click to uh come see what what you're advertising and a lot of people don't even don't even try to do what they're their title or their snapshot may indicate they're doing, and they're just off doing something else, and they, you know, they just go by somebody else's farm on a server or something like that, or they, they show a clip of something that they've seen, and go, oh, I wonder how you do that, that kind of stuff. It's very, it's kind of entertaining, and you know, it's like, all right, well, you got me, I guess. Um, good for you. we're doing this time. That's right. Let's go fishing. We did sleep last night, so we don't need to be overly concerned about um, I really do want to go explore all that. I'm wondering if that's a, a portal we've already checked out or something. I uh, just... The respiration is sitting back there in the uh, enchanting tower we built, and it's ready to go, but I just, I don't want to waste the levels. I want to get up to like 50 and do a bunch more tool enchants, getting multiple, uh, multiple goodies. Man. Don't mind me. I'm not here. Get. So now our second most exciting activity. Goodness is at least with the fishing, I get uh, more chance to drink coffee. But you can begin to see why with efficiency five, unbreaking three, and um, when I still need it, mending or silk touch, I will grab those no matter how bad the price is uh, 
because any one of them, you know, you can be hundreds, uh, you know, who knows? I, I'm scared to think how many different lecterns I've placed and broken without getting uh, that trade. In fact, is there a... I don't think lectern has a counter, does it? Interactance with lectern is zero. And there's no... We've done 532 trades, but that includes all the produce. That isn't just... And I don't think that counts not trade, you know. So... No, nothing, nothing to tell us how many times we might have tried for that. A few more of those sugar canes popping up. That's good. Drumming on my uh, stainless steel coffee cup here. some point we should maybe bring our raw fish from the base and the raw fish from this chest which isn't very much right now combine all those at the trading hall we can try to tame those cats something get started on piece of leather is never bad I don't know that I've caught a bone yet this game. That was unexpected. Definitely in the junk category, but different junk, so that's fun. Um, doing this. All right, right halfway. All I want to do is check the time, because I really had no idea what time I started at.
number two. It's not too bad. Eventually we can stack up any enchanted fishing poles we have. I think the only other one we've gotten so far has been a vanishing, so... That's another reason why I haven't I haven't worried at all about look of the sea or lure. Um, between this fishing and when we're eventually uh, going after more drowned, we'll, we'll just end up with lots of fishing poles and making a top tier on us is good. Of course, right now we don't have the unbreaking three, so we couldn't even do that. where they kind of pulled my chair forward and sat up and uh, I was worried that was going to be the chance when the bobber went but clearly I had a good 10 minutes tropical fish oh there's a little pre-dawn light I think just climbing up there we go Get this one more. Unload. Again, we probably don't have enough yet to uh, to get the cat, so we'll save that. Unfortunately, I have this horrible feeling we're going to be back. But now, quick race back over to catch our villager by the time he's finished with breakfast. They, they seem to have this little morning deal where they aren't ready to get new jobs for a little bit. So, enough time to rush back. Still don't know how I thought there was a village up there. I was certain I'd seen a house, though. All right, little villager. We got Going anywhere, pal. You give me unbreaking three, I will let you wander the halls all day. How about that, huh? It's your deal. You want you wanna go visit other people? Pay the price. We had done so much better the other day. Uh, prop 4, I think we already have one of those, right? 30? Or did we always get rid of it? Now I'm up to... Fleam? That's the mending guy. 
Prop 4, 33, so we're paying a little more. Let's check those others. I'd said I was going to do that. We probably should. That's our feather falling for high goal. That's our efficiency four, not five. Sweeping edge. Oh, yeah. Prop. Fortune. Smite. Healing. All right. three. Well, maybe we didn't have that one, but yeah, we've got it once. I don't think we ever had taken a power five, had we? I think we've seen it. It's just been too expensive. That is another one we could use quite a bit to make replacement bows. Oh, too, way too expensive for two. Real five. I think our six touch is like six, though. So you're on the right track, though. I got to tell you, man, you are coming up roses now. Price is kind of no object there. I mean, we may want one sharp five at some point, but one more. Actually, we may still be at sharp four. I mean, but 63 is still plenty pricey there. I'll just get this done, man.
got. Uh, it's so, so painful. I gotta just sit here and... Reset a bit. I'm also just changing the stuff I got quiet in the background. Alright, now... They're all now we're like in an awful series of bottom tier in chance. What's up with that, man? That loyalty was the last top tier one we saw. Yep, uh, it's close. That is the right trade at the wrong intensity. Um, I guess we haven't really talked about it in this run at all. So, the enchantments... Um, as far as I understand, in the, the librarians are, are pretty well balanced and random but then you have the the randomness within to uh wait we already oh, it's cheaper but i don't care we've got a prop for already um the random within and then they also have the randomness of the level of the enchantment so you kind of have to get double lucky and then it's triple to get the get the top tier of the enchant you want at a price that you want. So becomes a little bit like a slot machine. Now some of those as you can see it doesn't you know like silk touch, right? There's only one. So it doesn't matter. You're gonna see every silk touch you see is gonna be the one you want. But uh of these others. Oh no! Oh. Did you dodge me when I'm facing a gate? Okay. Um. <sighs> Back to more fish, I guess. See if we can end up combining a fishing route today. Look along this side this time. No boat bouncing around to scare the fish. Couldn't be set up better.
least they're quick. Wow. I wonder if, uh, how moons affect, like, mob spawning and all that. I wonder if they affect fish bite rates. It'd be a cool mechanic. I don't think they do, but. Like, having rain or evening or morning or anything like that would, would be good times to fish. Create zombie flesh. Woohoo! Zombie flesh! You can see I'm just kind of kind of chilling here. I don't know that constant commentary is required for a second night of fishing. Leather. I have a whole, whole new library shanty tail ready to go. leather at least you know this is the the kind of it's, it's so inefficient we'd be better off being in the desert just running around with our sword but we are creeping up a little bit more experience as we do this and most important of all we're growing the growing the sugar cane as we do Almost missed that one. I was about ready to move the mic and take a sip. Just getting cozy here on the mouse pad. Everything lined back up again. Another leather. Another leather. This is the great day of leather. 
day 214. It's kind of surprising we played that many uh, many Minecraft days in this. We're at, uh, I think this is maybe episode 45, if I remember correctly. Hey, level 45 on day 45. What a combination of fate. I just glanced down and happened to notice we're getting pretty low on this fishing rod, so we may as well combine it with the other. We plan to do that. Ooh, another fishing rod. That'll do us. Never did combine these. Oh, it was a bow. Hey. How did that bow ha Oh, because it, I never want mending on a bow. All right. Well, you go away. Cats in the bar in the trading hall. And don't worry, guys. If if you're hanging in here and hanging tough with me, I appreciate it. First of all, but uh, don't worry. Tomorrow night we sleep to keep the phantoms away. So a break from the fishing, which just means twice as much villager fun. Yeah, that should be our metric of the book. How many times do we hear this song? Between now and when we get it. All right. No offense, dude, but I'm um, kind of <sighs> teasing me now. Kind of done with you. So, at this point, it doesn't even really have to be Unbreaking 3. Just give me something that I can feel good about taking from you. It's not something I already have. You 
You're doing better. You're trying hard. I can tell. See baby villagers over there, so that's good. Seem to have missed that little good window. Three and three, we already got that one. Tier one though. Another falling two. That wasn't. I saw the high number. I was got excited. Must be something different about my. Lectern placing, mouse placement, and my fishing because all of a sudden I'm totally back. For one thing, it's the turning. The wrist drags it as you go back and forth a little bit. I don't think I've done channeling yet, right? That was a seven channeling. Uh, is that any more important than like loyalty though? It's cheap. Gets me paper. Gets me out of this court. No, 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 no. I'm not going to be weak. Um. I don't think I want to pay top tier for a power five either, right? What do I forget again? Impaling. Prot. Mending. Sil flame. Silk's over here. Silk. Looting. Infinity. Sweeping, efficiency, and feathers. So no power, but 64 is way too much for that. Because that's one I will buy over and over and over again. That's still what you're sitting on? Yeah. And... And done. Sign. That's awesome. Get out of the way. At 32, is that right? 37. Finally, sir, we were able to make a deal. No, no, no. I told you you could walk around, but I told you you needed to uh, give me an in 3 for that. 
All right, next up, sir. Let's do this quickly. So now eventually we can take the other guy that we'd had and move him back to the village with Farmer Fred. Because I'll never buy that efficiency for now. Or I think maybe, eh, it might have been 30 that we got that for, but the saved enchantments and levels and everything will be well worth it. You're trying, dude. I, I like your early enthusiasm. Uh, what was that? 21? Um, it's kind of silly, but I want to keep this. I want to keep this momentum going. Look at the C3 and paper for 21. Oh wait, now I've been now I've been reckless. Luck of C three twenty three. Was that one? <laughs> no, I don't remember. Paper. I know twenty one. Whatever. How often are we gonna buy that? Don't you go in there, dude. He's, I can't stop him, but... I bought luck of the sea from your buddy there. You gotta keep this little center part on the up and up here. It's for the pride of your area. Right. You're stuck. Go back, go to bed. to bed. I'm going to go to bed, I think. Oh, wait, are there still cats? Or do the cats all run away now? Hey, what are you doing, dude? What are you guys doing? Um, here, let's get you beds. All right, you should be good to go, dude. 
I don't know if that's too far for you or what, but go get a bed. Go get a bed. They're back in the corner there. Go on. Go get a bed. If I have those two and I'm three more, can I make more black turns now? Do I have, oh, I have one more. It'll keep me going for a bit. Well, I don't see any cats. like 8 million cats around when you don't want them. Oh, I missed all that. Alright. Back to work, you and I. Very expensive silk touch. Get to dance a bunch, huh? Well, actually, you can do this again, can't you? Last prompt. Power 5, I want a sharp 5, but those have to be at the right price. But a level 3 res, which I don't think I have for the teens, is not bad. Alright, you got me, pal. Which was it, 18? Oh, by the way, in case you're actually, oh man, in case you're actually watching, um, we may go long here, because why break to have multiple episodes that people are like, eh, whatever, I'll just check in at the end, see what the prices were. Huh? 
Yeah. Saw the price and got excited. Sharpness, uh, by the way, is one of the ones that you really do not want a four on. Um, sharpness and smite both, because the swords get so many enchantments that combining the force can actually put you in trouble where you can't get everything you want onto them. So, a little tip there. I mean, Grant, what do you what do you really want fours in? There's not much. Feather falling and prot four. Or two. Any day, any day now. There you go. Depth Strider. Kind of appealing, actually, but one, we've already got it, and two, uh, all right, quit your freaking. Oh, Inspiration. Frostwalker is a good one, but um, Did not already take that, right? That's that's one we may do. Let's just go double check. Rest three. Luck of the sea. Efficiency. Fortune. Smite. I think that's the one I was worried about. Farmers. Yeah, that's why when you're when you're rolling these, sometimes you'll see me pass by a good one. Again, never pass up on breaking or efficiency, no matter the price. You can always get them cheaper. And this guy, we can actually take away and replace. So that's a, a potential next bed. Um, but yeah, I think we're gonna gonna take our sharp five for twenty nine. And now, let's 
Let's get your bookcase moved over. Now we need to get uh, more emeralds, sadly. So despite what I said, um, we still ended up finding enough goodies to not achieve my full goal. Alright, let's fish those up. Wait, how did I get... Oh, maybe I... Okay. Better. All we need are signs. Da, 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 da. Oh, I didn't realize they were tripling. Forgot about that. We got a lot of signs. That's right. We can use them for water control and all that other good stuff. Okay, well, now we can keep trading on. Alright, your buddy did well for me. Uh, last time, yours was garbage. Uh, I'm not falling for that. <laughs> We've picked up a lot of marginally good stuff. Any cats? Meow, meow, meow. Um. few more of those while we're thinking about it. Oh, that was a big mistake on the slabs. Should have just made more of these, I guess, but we'll see how far this gets us. Two, three, four, five, six. I think that's uh right amount of slabs. Right. Oh no, I miscounted. Darn it. Yeah, someday I'll just need more. I should have done a whole bunch, but we got inventory to preserve here. How would I do in my bed? Uh, it's up here. Jerk cat. Where are you, you dumb cat? Oh no. Brown. Hey, we got a kitty. Come on. Okay. Whoop. No, don't get greedy. 
Actually, I should have you come chill right out here. Keep the creepers at bay. Alright, we got a kitty cat. Well, that was fun. This is not, if it's going to be an anthropod day, we're going to be in trouble, you and I. See, that could, that could be the first efficiency five at 64. We got ours for 37. Heck of a deal. Flipping pages of books. We already got a fortune. book. I want to move on.
these times. It's going to be such a party when it happens. No. cheap lure. It's a really cheap channeling too, but again, gotta focus in here. I bought too much peripheral junk along the way. We'll get all these these other ones easily after. So it's about this time that I think, you know, maybe we we would have just been better to try for the zombies first, do the curing that way. Because at least then you take out all the, uh, the price deal. You get the best option every time. So there's none of that. You know, you're you're taking one of the wheels of the slot machine away. Um, do on this night as it begins really nothing I don't think Sir, this is that breakfast time. It's right there. Well, look at it. <sighs> Maybe after a good breakfast, he'll be uh, he'll be ready. On breaking three. On breaking three. On breaking three. Instead, you gave me a crazy expensive mending. Alright. Now I see how it's going to be again today. expensive mending. What are you doing, dude? Put them all the way. I don't get it confused. I'm not I'm not asking you for a cheaper mending. Already got that.
I think our efficiency five is cheaper though. But of course, now we see those all the time. of efficiency now. Punch only go up to two? I can't remember. Not that we're taking it right now. Now you're just rubbing it in. Nobody likes to show off, man. Just beyond words. Oh, this has just been going on too long. I'm beginning to miss the <laughs> swinging axes at non-existent lecterns. I'm trying to put stakes onto walls. <sighs> no, I'm not going to do it. That's really good, though.
These are all trials of my my faith and resilience now. We will get the Unbreaking 3 book, Librarian. If you've got it in there somewhere in your pockets. you got deep pockets, my friend. Deep pockets. Somewhere in those deep pockets. I saw the 54. I was like, they're going to make me pay for them now. No, no, no. See, I know you're tired and frustrated, little guy, but just think of it this way. For all the years after, you and I are going to be the best of buds. I'm going to come to see you more often than anybody else. Okay. Not tonight, though. Um... Seems like every time I come back, there's something else I meant to do. Oh, I know. It was to tell the cat how awesome the cat is. Uh, I don't have... Well, I have my one boat here. Hey, yeah, for those of you staying on to uh, as we approach the end of the second hour, thanks so much for hanging out. You guys are you're a special bunch, hanging deep on the uh, on the Let's Play meta. Breaking one. All right, maybe this is the unbreaking day. Yeah, start small, right? That was like the comic book version of Unbreaking. At some point, we may help, hope to get that like hard, hardbound, nice dust jacket version. But what we're looking for is the first edition, the top creme de la creme, signed maybe by Mr. Unbreaking. Ugh, excuse me. Lulling me into a, a trance here. That or it's just all the uh, air pollution. Two. All right, we're moving. We're moving. That you're going the right way, bud. Keep it up. You can do this. I got faith.
Come on, man. Just, just find it. <sighs> that might have been the highest level piercing, but I don't care. So many, I mean, hundreds and hundreds of these, I would think. <sighs> I need a nap after this. Again, I think punch two is the top there. Multi shot. Walker. Efficiency garbage. Smite garbage. Paper. Aqua. Oh, man. Stop dodging me! Oh, you little jerk. A lot of binding curses you've been throwing my way, pal. Not real happy about it.
I guess this at least exper increases the rate at which we can see books. That's good. That's where we're not going to have to spend a bunch of XP to repair the stupid axe, because this will be the next four hours. Uh, I guess we'll stick with that, though. All right, there's another cat. I rolling around in here. There it is. Kind of blocking my view, man. Torch. I knew that was going to happen. All right, we got cats. Give me something. No. Hey, I got a rabbit fur. Very nice, kitty. Thank you. All right. Back to the old grind. At least we had a kitty to... Kitty to snuggle with. Now he's going to be in the way, aren't you? Can you sit next to the... I brought you a friend, a cat, to hang out with, man. So this really better make this the day. This is the day that the cat has made. Let us rejoice and trade books in it. An Unbreaking 3 book. There you go. Alright, you got it? No.
There's another one. I guess we're going to work our way back up the ladder, kitty cat. Get out of my way. Hey. What? You want it over there? I'll go over here for a while. Someday, 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 someday. So when I said that uh, perseverance was needed and all that kind of stuff, I didn't think this was going to quite be it. Okay, why, if you ever get unbreaking and efficiency, just take them. Race is no object. I'm kind of surprised as how plentiful mending seems to be these in this world, at least.
All right, guys. Rubber chickens. Incense. Sensors, is that what those are called? Things they, they swing on the chain and I think it's like European churches and stuff. Do they do that in the United States at all? I don't know. First edition. Uh, that's what we were talking about, buddy. Usually means it's about nighttime, right? He does his little pause. <laughs> yeah, I woke him up. Alright, go back to bed, doofus. Oh my goodness, guys. <sighs> Two hours in. Said the song. Cool. Wasting all our time. We're trying to look at a bunch of trades here, man. Every time you bobble around and...
Next time I see those, like, 30 to 20 for efficiency 5. Are you kidding me, dude? Come on, man. Oh. What are these trades? At least that was an expensive one. I think we've seen double digits of efficiency fours and fives since we took the one, and we've only seen a handful of unbreaking ones and twos. And I don't think it's wrong. I'm wondering if if we're just getting horrible RNG or if they nerfed uh, nerfed unbreaking from the librarians to make it a little tougher because it is it is by far the right up there with mending the most useful because it goes on everything right every single thing that you have wants unbreaking. Silk touch section. Yeah, that was a, an extreme breath out into the microphone. Sorry about that. Hey. 
right. <laughs> Not as cheap as I would like, but we will take it. Oh my goodness, over two hours of pretty much non-stop. Go ahead and take two of those. Unbreaking three for 32. Right. Wow. That was a lot. Don't think we ever ended up with the power five, did we? Oh, that efficiency 5 for 20 was crazy. I thought it was what it was. We did not get a power. We got a sharpness. Oh, and I put those fish. No, I didn't put the fish away. Come here, last cat. Finish us up strong. All right. Now, you. And you, come on. Come on. Both of you two, come here. Hey, come here. Hey, where are you going? wrong with you two? Come here. What? Okay. <laughs> Whatever that had to be. Wow. Little bird of cat. Add that to our totals. Well, guys, I think I'm going to uh, sleep here, but let's just chill for a second, because we're definitely going to end up this episode. Uh, as you can see from the yawning, I need a break for sure. Um, and I don't know, I don't know what I'm going to do after that. Um... We'll see what the break does. I, I may be back with uh, with some more fire to... Uh... Oh, you know what I should do? Where are my kitty cats? Come here. Come here, kitty cats. Put your butt down. Hey, put your butt... Put your butt down. Come here. What the heck did, are those guys doing... Come here and sit on these chests at least, you dumb cats. Come here, dumb cat. Alright, my goodness. Oh, well, that's good. Alright. Now, let's do... All right. That's good. So we'll park it up and sleep here. And let's go ahead and save and quit. This was another long one for sure, but uh, I didn't. I 
didn't want to drag that into a whole day's worth of stops and starts and everything. So uh, we just hung on until we got it done. And I appreciate anybody who's stuck with it. Give yourself a firm pat on the back. You are amazing. Uh, for everybody like me, it was like, yeah, I'll just keep clicking along. We finally got it. Unbreaking 3 is in our set. And uh, next up is knocking out a few levels, getting those enchants applied, and... Um, very likely heading into the nether shortly. Um, it may take us an episode or so to get in there, but I uh, want to rack up a bunch of levels, turn things pretty quickly so that we can get um, get set to Darkroom Spawner. Because now we need, uh, need to turn our levels. So that's... Uh, that's kind of the plan. We'll see how it all pans out for us. But uh, again, thanks so much for hanging out. If you did, um, I'm just glad to be done with it. That, that felt very grindy the last couple of days. So we'll get back to uh, some more running around and fun. Hopefully you guys enjoy that. And uh, I can't wait to see you guys back, whether it's uh, later today or, uh, or in the coming. So you guys take care. See you next time. Bye.